Hello, I just wanted to give a little update what I'm up to. Uh, I found out I'm going to have a little bit of money from tax return from Colorado and I was, I was like, what should I do? I was thinking about maybe starting my own server to put my audio encyclopedia on. But then I was like, uh, I can do that later. I think I'll go bike touring in Europe because... You know, it's been like nine years since I've traveled and I haven't been in like biking shape for like that long or longer. So I'm like, let's go bike touring. And I'm, now I'm like really excited about it. So as soon as I get these checks, I don't know when exactly they're going to be or how much, but hopefully within like a month or something, I'll get some money and be able to go like in the beginning of April or something, bike touring all over Europe. And I wanted to show my bike because I'm really excited about bike touring and broadcasting my bike tour on YouTube because because it's just like it's like you're not doing it alone you know and then you can like inspire people to do it too and show people the way I do it and stuff and it's just exciting you know and uh, it's not exciting for me to bike tour because I haven't bike toured for, for a long time now and last time you know there was no such thing as mp3 so I'm gonna have mp3 with my so, uh, solar thing to charge mp3 i'm gonna have my computer with me so i can charge my mp3 with that i can do like computer out in the woods you know and um and then i can broadcast it and it's just oh, i'm just real excited so um but okay so i'm gonna do bike tour speed it's all my whole bike tours designed for speed because you know it'll be the least less it'll be most exciting that way um i want to like try and get strong um, put myself through lots of pain and become super strong and then do show up at some of the races and you know and see how well I can do at the races when I come home like the 24 hour races and stuff which I've never raced one before and I've only ridden 24 hours a couple times in my life but um, I remember once I did a 30 hour ride in Australia and um, I felt awesome after 30 hours I wasn't even tired at all my joints were like you know that was it so I'm, I'm excited to go and try that again. So anyways, here's my bike. Um, I have a cool way also of like, I'm going to like compare, I'm going to have like, every day I ride, I'm going to ride, see how fast I can ride 10 miles and have like at the 10 mile record. And I have all these times to compare myself because there's this time trial from Lions to Boulder and I have it on my website. Like I have it the, of all the people and of like 35 like chicks who were like way fucking fa faster than I was when I tried it. I think, like I did in 33.09, 10.1 miles, so. But I, anyways, I think I'll be able to do a lot faster than that once I'm strong, even even though I have a loaded down bike. Because check this out. I'm bike touring, I've got a loaded down bike, but it's fast. So check it out. Plus I'm going to have like 12 hour record for myself, 24 hour record for myself, 200 mile record, 100 mile record, all these records that I'm going to try and break every single day. But here's my bike. That's the bike bicycle bike touring designed for speed see I have the arrow wheels and it's also you know it's also designed for sturdiness I want it to be aerodynamic fast and sturdy and stiff to be fast bike so that's everything now that backpack that's got everything I'm gonna bring so I think normally it will be even less packed than that maybe I'll bring a tiny little satchel that I can bring stuff on my back now look, I've got three. I've got four water bottles. Those three, and then the guy on the top there, so that I can have water to bring to my campsite and stuff. And uh, check this out. Um, this is very sturdy. This is pegged between the the frame there, so this can't move at all. And this is like totally jet, totally sturdy on top because I've got this cinched, this cinched, and then on the back I've got it cinched down to the back with that red one. Gonna have to figure out a way to keep those things from tangling up into my spokes though. Okay, so, and then there's the front. So check this out. Check it out, check it out, check it out. I'll show, I'll show what I've got going down. Dun, 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 dun. Oh cool, only 435, man. Okay, so, this is my, t here, take this off. So all I have to do is push the red button, and then this slides up. Um, and I forgot to show. I've got a light here. Here's my light. Not to shoot shoot the road, just for so cars can see me. And then on the back, I have cinched to the rack the rear rear light. 
So, this is my front. This guy on the top is my, I was going to have my mom film me, but she was like, tomorrow. So I was like, screw that. Tomorrow my ass. We're going to do it. So here's my tent. Here's my, here's my bag and I'll show you what I have. Let's see here. Dun, 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 dun. Okay. So, in this bag in the front here, I'll have my leather mat, my little Allen wrenches. I'm gonna have mace because I'm gonna be sleeping outside every night. I don't want to have to hurt a dog or something. Okay, and then here's my little solar thing which I can open up and attach to the top of the thing so I don't really have to worry about my mp3s running out of energy the idea is to be able to ride all day long and listen to mp3 you know ed educate myself while I'm riding or listen to music we'll see I'll probably listen to plenty of mp3 here on the top I have sensed you know my little wireless computer and check this out though this is really cool if this video goes over 10 minutes, I'll just make it two parts because, check this out. This is what it's going to be like when I walk around town. The idea is to be able to just lock my bike up anywhere and then walk around town, you know, check stuff out with everything that I have and just leave my bike locked someplace and uh, not have too much stuff. Also, you know, there's two advantages to traveling very lightly. You can ride very fast and you can walk around town without any trouble. So anyways, oops. So I'll show you how it's going to be like walking around town. Take this off. Hmm, how am I going to keep these things? I'm getting tangled in the spokes. Hmm, I wonder. So long. I should have gone to the store and bought the short ones. <laughs> okay. Get the rear one out. Alright, check this out. Okay. Walk around town. This like that, and then check this out. Just sling this thing over my shoulder like this. And there you go, walking around. Or if I want to like do a lot of walking. I can set it up like this. Watch that. Like this. Check this out. Hands free, totally sturdy. You can walk around. Get everything. So, whoops, looks like that's about it for the first video. <laughs>